Did you? You got hit by a single apple and died. Ah, oh, you've got to be. It's seriously a single apple and you die. How? I mean, I know one apple a day keeps a doctor away, but this is just over the top. So, obviously the Divine Arbiters are not the way to go with Bob Ross. Which means Chronomancer. It, it is my weakness over here. It's not going to do a lot, but I can... I can maybe stop a few in the tracks, maybe it's... Ah. Maybe this can work, maybe. It's still a large group of people, but... At the same time, that large group of people might not be able to stand a chance against me. Because you don't have a powerhouse. Technically, you still have a powerhouse in Bob Ross, but... Come on, just freeze time. Please. God. Ah. Alright, Chronomancer and Radiant Glaives. It's not gonna work, but... I need to get rid of the Bob Ross people. Like... Okay, I need to be lucky that I slow the wheelchair itself, or the wheelchair, uh, the wheelbarrow itself. But that's not happening. It's really not happening. All I got is a little bit of a power boost right over here, but there's still just... The bloody apples, they hurt a lot, surprisingly. Did they always do so much damage? Come on, Chronomancer, you got this. Please. Oh, you haven't got this. Okay, how about I can place quite a few of these all around, so maybe Bob Ross focuses on someone else. Maybe. I doubt it, but maybe. Like, that attack right now, instantly, with a burst of lightning. Come on, there we go. Awesome. Is the Arbiter still alive? The Arbiter is still alive. The Arbiter is dead because Bob Ross got too close. Why? Why? It's working though. It's sort of working. Arbiter. Further back. Come on. Come on. Come on. Also, I'm thinking that maybe this was a bad idea. Again, a single apple. Ah. Okay. Clear this. Divine Arbiter. Devout Gauntlet. Uh, let's see how do we do this best. I think I need to... I don't need to do that. I think I need to work in some kind of egg-like shape. I, I don't see it working. Because they just burst through and all of a sudden they start attacking me. They... See, he instantly goes for me. Stop going for me. I need you to stop doing that. It's all about placement. Ah, uh, okay. You go here. Uh, could I maybe draw the attention away like this? Like, I need to stop them from actually going after my Arbiter. If they... Could you stop going after me? Come on. <sighs> okay, 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 not working, not working, not working at all. I need more, I need more, I need more. Two Arbiters. Line of you, does that work? Maybe, come on, you focus on the ones in the middle, there we go. Oh, that's better. That Eh, still a bird, still a bird, come on. Do another attack. Good, good. Explode, explode, explode. Yes! Oh, now we've got it. Now we've got it. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Come on. A little bit more. Survive. Survive. Don't. Die. Don't. You survive that. Of course you're not surviving that, but hey, that went better. Still not as burnt as I hoped it would be, but... It sort of worked, which means uh, the Celestial Aegis doesn't do an awful lot. It has a little bit of range though, but I'm not sure if this is what I need. I'm not sure if this is what I need. But the Arbiters are working. If they can explode the Bob Ross fella. Can you just... 
can't you just fall off? Please. Do me a favor. Oh, no. Oh, this is bad. Oh, you're still alive. Oh, please tell me we got this now. Please tell me we got this now. Oh, you. Walk back. Walk back. Walk back. Walk back. Survive. 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 Survive! Survive! Come on! Come on! Come on! It's a little bit No, no, no! Don't be so fast! Don't be so fast! Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? Oh, it's just a matter of seconds at that point. Oh, but this is working. Okay. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. Can I do anything with you? You don't do anything at all. Do you just get close and deal damage? I think you just get close and deal damage. I think you just get close and you get close and die. You get close and die. You get close and die. Count. No. Oh, this is not working. Okay. I'm wondering if you guys need to go away. Maybe Radiant Glaive? Maybe. Okay, how about two more of you gone to Radiant Glaives? One of you over here, one of you over there. Come on. And here we go. Just attack whatever you can. Attack whatever you can. Oh, please, please. Get the Bob Ross fella. Get the Bob Ross fella. Get the Bob Ross fella. No. Okay, this is good. This is good. Uh, still not amazing. Still not amazing. Still not amazing. But maybe we have it. Maybe, maybe we have it. Maybe we have it. Maybe we have it now. Come on. Come on. No more apple throwing for you. No more apple throwing for you. No, 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 oh, are you kidding me? I hate you. Okay, first move, stay away. Let them do the thing. First hit, and then we charge, then we charge, then we charge, then we charge. Come on, come on. Here we go, here we go. Just cause mayhem, cause mayhem, cause... Why is there still... Bob Ross fella alive. Come on. Get those scythe people. Get those scythe people right now. Are they dead? Oh, thank God. Oh, that took longer than I hoped it would. But hey, in the end, it works. Again, taking control. I don't survive these levels if I don't take control. Definitely not. Oh, which means royal pain in the backside arches with four kings oh boy oh boy oh boy the chronomancer could work in this case uh but i'm thinking celestial ages like okay my chronomancer stops the kings in their tracks for the most part deals a fair bit of damage for the most part um these guys have to take care of the archers is that going to work is that going to work like that is working sort of and then we help each other with the shields sort of this is good this is good the kings are still alive though uh, not a single king is dead not a single king is dead not a single king is destroyed come on destroy one of the kings why is one of them entirely black i'm not entirely sure why ah there we go and he's I am not surviving this. Oh dear God. Divine Arbiters maybe? In that case? Like I need to work with the Celestial Ages. But Divine Arbiter might be able to actually cause some mayhem too. Okay. Three Arbiters and the rest Celestial Ages. Like right over here. Celestial Ages to stop the archery attacks. Hopefully, come on, come on, turn around, do your damage, use the lightning bolt attacks and whatever, like, light from the sky, death from above, destroy, obliterate them, come on, come on Arbiters, come on Arbiters, you got this, you got this, you got this, oh, we've only got one more shield remaining, come on, please, just destroy them, just destroy them, no, don't, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I shall not lose today. I refuse to lose. You were saying? I refuse to lose today. 
I refuse to lose today. I refuse to lose today. Come on, you bloody kings. You will be destroyed. You will be destroyed. The archers too will be destroyed. I will focus on them for the most part for as far as I can. There we go. That is so much better. So much better. Ah, again, such a different result if I take control. Oh, which means a deadly barricade. Deadly barricade. Because you've got bloody bards. Oh dear. Yeah, that's a lot of you. Uh, Chronomance is not going to work. Divine Arbiter would work. Would destroy a lot quickly. Again, it's the hope. So, two of you, Celestial Age Surround, that seems to be the most valid plan of action, I hope. It works before, though. They might... They might have too many archers. Can you regenerate your shields, maybe, or something? Nope, definitely not. Apparently they can, but the time it takes for that to happen is too long for us to keep them alive in. Not impossible, but we might need a different plan. Cool. Radiant Glaive in that case? Like, yes, Arbiter works. Radiant Glaive has a shield as well, but it's... They've just got so much power. A few ages in between. Would this work? Would this work? Only one Arbiter, unfortunately. But it's power. A little bit of power. Their archers are just so powerful. Oh, come on. Destroy the knight. Destroy the knight. Focus on the arch. That's not going to work. Oh, boy. How am I going to do that? How am I going to do that like i could place paladins over here the go-to plan would be to place a single arbiter take control of it and just fire away uh, that's not it that's not it chronomancer it's not gonna work it's just not powerful enough one radiant glaive maybe uh okay the arbiter is gonna be a little bit closer I'm going to try it like this, and then I'm going to try and take control, see if that changes anything. It will. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought, wait, did you just kill my Chronomancer instantly? There's no way you can survive this. <laughs> Definitely not. Oh my god. Okay. You know what? Fine. Deadly barricade. Deadly indeed. Okay, you go over there, you go over there, protect me, somehow, and here we go, here we go, just attack, just attack, this will focus on whatever in the distance, this will focus on whatever in the distance, something will die, oh dear, this is so bad, this is so bad, there's, there's way too many archers, oh my god. Alright, how about this then? Several Aegises and a few Paladins. Maybe draw fire in different locations. Maybe it's... The archers are just so deadly. How do I get rid of the tons of archers? Like, they just slaughter everything. This seems to be working though. A little bit at least. Uh, it's still not gonna be enough. They've got so many of them. I just need to survive, and I'm not surviving, because that is all. That is all I've got. And that's just one part of the circle gone. The shield is working. The shield is working. It's not going to be enough. Come on. Come on. Block all those attacks. Block all those attacks. It's not working. But that might be the key, though. I might have to work with these guys. What if I place them all together? And one Radiant Glaive. Would that change anything at all? Like, it's a shield. It's the shield. The shields work. It's just not as powerful as I would have hoped. Oh, come on. Come on. We totally haven't got this. Oh, dear. We've got a few of them remaining. Oh, 
Just raise your shield, please! Okay, two Arbiters, three Paladins. Maybe with a bit of force, they're going to be way too close, but maybe they're close. You're supposed to be aiming at uh, the Paladins. <laughs> Just no doing this. No! Definitely not, definitely not. Or might the answer actually be the Sacred Elephants still? Like I haven't used them, they can throw some spears. They're just going to die instantly, aren't they? Come on, can you do anything to any of them? Oh, we're so dead. We're so dead. There's one elephant down. No. How do you destroy an army of archers like this? All right, plan, I don't know how many. Small army over here. Back up, plan. Right on top of here, right on top of here. Come on, just destroy them from above. Destroy them from above, hide behind. Have some backup. There we go, this is working, this is totally working. Oh, you guys are not, oh, you're not supposed to be looking at me. You're not supposed to be looking at me. Oh, I'm so gonna be dead. I know this is cheating, but oh my God, how? How am I even supposed to do anything against this? Come on, come on, just destroy them, just destroy them, just destroy them, they can't hit me, they can't hit me, surely, surely they can't hit me, come on, are you dead yet, come on, you're all just waiting down there aren't you, can you, can you please go and die, thank you, <laughs> Yes, I know it's cheating, but I've been trying this for several minutes right now and I was not making any progress. If this is how I'm going to do it and it works, I'll take the bloody victory. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, every single, or most of these levels, it's like I've got a tiny group of Chronomancer people. And, uh, Small budget, small space. I'm just dying. You've got Zeus. Like, oh my god. Okay. Uh, elephant's not going to work. I could go for a Chronomancer. Uh, Divine Arbiter on top of this, maybe? <laughs> Zeus is just going to cause chain lightning and all that kind of stuff and cause issues. But hey, maybe. Maybe. Come on, miss me. Good, that's good, that's good. Just miss me, just miss me. Don't fall off. Don't, don't fall off. Don't. Idiots! Why are you walking? Oh my god. I'm working with fools. All you have to do, all you bloody have to do is stand here. There we go. Just aim at him. Nothing wrong, you aim at the toughest person in the crowd. That's what you do with the bullies, or whatever the saying is. They can't hit me, you just stay on top of here. That will be called tactics in a totally accurate battle. Is that too much to ask? Clearly it is, but are you still alive? Who is still, are you still alive? You're still alive. Can you not? Thank you. Okay, who is still alive? Someone is alive. Also, we fell off. We survived. That's already a plus, but oh my god. If you just stay put, it's just so easy. So much easier. Ah. Okay. If I knew how to re-try this battle instantly, I would do it because I would have a different plan for this. So I tried to go back to the previous level and it didn't really do much because my plan was to actually use a flag bearer of the secret faction. But it's not present in the secret faction, it's the legacy faction. So whatever plan I had, it didn't work anyway. Uh, but I still don't understand why secret is available, yet everywhere grayed out like why why do you show this to me when i come to use like sure there are two units secret units for in this case fantasy good which makes me guess we've also got a fantasy evil which explains the second faction in that case but yeah we'll have to deal with good uh anyway 
Minotaurs, Zeus, Snake Archers. Problematic, to say the least. Which means, again, limited budgets. Don't like it. Uh, yeah. Would a Celestial Aegis work against the Snake Archers? I don't think it would. Find Gauntlets could maybe work. Uh, we'll keep Chronomancer safe and one Paladin. Would this do anything to them? Maybe. Okay, the first hit of the snake works. But after that, not so much. Not so much at all. Okay, come on, Chronomancer. Do your thing, do your thing. Destroy them, destroy them. Please. You're not going to destroy them. You're still not going to destroy them. Just focus on Zeus. Really? You're, you're supposed to be all-powerful. You're supposed to be all-powerful. And it turns out that the best thing I can do is just use several of these Arbiters. Like, that works. That works. It just... Okay, maybe not entirely, because the snakes are going to destroy me one by one. Yeah, the snakes are going to destroy me one by one. Uh, how about in that case... Okay, Radiant Glaives. Maybe. Three, four... Something. Come on. We've got the power. Oh. I hate how powerful Minotaurs are when they just race through my units. Oh dear. Yeah, destroy the snakes. Destroy the snakes. And stay alive. Stay alive was your job. Okay. That doesn't work. Minotaurs are too powerful when rushing through. So if we place you a little bit further back. Would that help? Would that help? The Minotaurs rush through, and then we start with the light magic. Uh, maybe, 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 maybe. Well, kill the Minotaur before you die. Okay, good enough, good enough, good enough, good enough. Now, come on, come on, destroy, destroy. Uh, this is chain lightning again. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Righteous paladins in that case. Several of them without gauntlets in the middle. I'm gonna go for the. Ar. 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 Yeah, I forgot your name. I forgot your name. I don't care. No. Hi, friends. Did you just. It sounded like you broke my neck, which might very well be exactly what just happened. And that's painful and terrifying. And, uh, at least Zeus is gone, but other than that, the Mayantors are having a party. Oh no, wait, Zeus is still alive. One of the Zeus's is gone. Oh boy. Not exactly what I had in mind. Which means, I'm just going to stay on the side over here where nobody is. Can I destroy the snake arches? Maybe. Stop them from causing pain and havoc. No, Minotaur, stay away from me. No snake archer. No, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Kill the Minotaur, kill the Zeus, I'm so dead. Oh, there's no way I'm going to survive this. There's no way I'm going to survive this. Oh, I'm so dead, I'm so dead, I'm so dead. Oh, there's a snake here, there's a snake here. There's... No, there's snakes here, not the snakes. Why are the snakes a thing? God. Okay, okay, okay. Different plan, hopefully. Archers here. Uh... With a Aegis at the side to maybe sort of protect them. We then need the Devout Gauntlets to maybe draw the attention of our Minotaur friends. Uh, we can get a Righteous Paladin. Do we want the Sacred Elephant? Sacred Elephant could maybe work. Uh, let's have two more of these. Okay, surely this must work, right? There we go. That's one Snake Archer gone. Are you dead? Yes, you are. That's works as the snake archers destroyed that gives me a lot more opportunity to focus hope oh the lightning doesn't work on my shield nice <laughs> really 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 that went brilliantly how god okay um not entirely according to Plan, that's the elephant gone. Okay, uh, how do I do this? How do I do this? I think Righteous Paladins might be powerful enough, but I'm not sure. Maybe an Arbiter. Okay, how about I place the Arbiter over there? 
Uh, I'm wondering, should I place an Arbiter at the top here? So that means the middle is entirely weak. Weaker than it already is. But it is a little bit of power. I'm also thinking maybe more of the Celestials, the shields and such. Maybe have some more power. Did you just... You missed. You're not supposed to miss. Because that, no, that means my shield is going to be gone. Bloody snakes. Come on, Arbiter. Do your thing. Do your thing. Don't die. Don't... Don't die. So easy. Just don't die. Ah. Uh, yeah. No. That's not working. Okay. Arbiter. You need to stay further away, apparently. Let's try this. See if it works. Like, that works. The the first shot works, but then you totally miss, and you, you let them fire the snake, and that's where it goes wrong. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, fine. You, Glaive, further back. A little bit more aiming time. There we go. That's the first hit. And then... Oh, truly! Truly! If you let the snake do its thing, it's going to cause trouble like that. God. Okay, you know what? You know what? Go away, you stupid glaive. You're not working. Uh, how about another Aegis? And same over here, I guess. Glaive gone, another Aegis. And let's have one Aegis over here. We'll help with the, protect uh, with the protection against Zeus. Come on. There we go. That's one shot. That's... You're not helping. Come on, destroy the snake. Thank you. That's more like it. That's more like it. Arbiter, stay back. Do your thing. Do your thing. Stay back. Don't let the Minotaurs get close. That's Zeus. Gone. Almost. Please. Oh, Arbiter, stay back. Stay back. Just destroy him from a distance. Destroy him from a distance. Don't be killed. You're my wild card. Yep, this is working. Finally. Finally. Oh, boy. I love those shields. Against an entire army, though, they don't block everything. They have a limit. And I'm not sure if it is just, okay, you can take several hits and it slowly recovers over time. Or if it breaks, does it eventually end up recovering? It's all small questions that I won't be able to find the answer to unless I look stuff up. But for now, it works. We won. There's a lot of interesting details one can find out when they look online for the unit info. For example, did you know that the Chronomancer transforms after attacking 8 times and that the clock on his back signifies that? Well, now you know. <laughs>